Super Mario Maker for Wii U was revealed all the way back at E3 2014. While fans were hoping to catch a glimpse of the next true Mario game, Nintendo surprised everyone by giving the keys to the Mushroom Kingdom to players. Instead of playing Mario's next big game, Nintendo asked fans to create it. The same tools developers had at their disposal were now readily available to the consumer. Super Mario Maker didn't make its way to retail shelves until September 2015, but once it launched, it quickly became one of the star titles in the Wii U's lineup. Super Mario Maker is one of, if not the perfect game to show Nintendo's original vision for the Wii U gamepad. Now Super Mario Maker is expanding upon its Wii U success with a 3DS outing. Just how well does Super Mario Maker translate to the dual screens of the 3DS? Let's dive in and take a look. For all intents and purposes, Super Mario Maker for 3DS accurately replicates the experience of the Wii U version. Most of the content you'll be looking for is made to transition without concession. You're still able to build, create, and play Mario platforming levels that utilize the Super Mario Bros., Super Mario Bros. 3, Super Mario World, and new Super Mario Bros. styles. All the level hazards, enemies, and power-ups have made the leap to 3DS as well, minus the mystery mushroom. That lack of mystery mushroom actually does impact the game in a notable way, but we'll get into that later. While Super Mario Maker's level building content has made the jump without issue, the ease of creation has suffered a bit. On the Wii U, players had the Wii U gamepad as their input method. The gamepad screen offers a much larger playing area, making for easier input. Shrinking that experience down to the 3DS's bottom screen certainly makes things feel a bit cramped. Again, all the content you want is right there on the 3DS touchscreen, but the room you have to maneuver around can leave you feeling a bit claustrophobic. The area where Super Mario Maker for 3DS takes a really big hit is the online features. While the original Super Mario Maker let you create and share your custom levels online, Super Mario Maker for 3DS doesn't let you upload your designs. You only have the option to share them locally with other 3DS players or via Street Pass. On top of that, while the 3DS version lets you go online and access a large amount of Wii U user-created levels, a portion of them will be unavailable. This is due to the 3DS version's lack of Mystery Mushroom. User-made levels from the Wii U version that featured a Mystery Mushroom simply wouldn't function correctly in the 3DS version, so they've been yanked altogether. While Super Mario Maker for 3DS clearly has a few cut features, there's one new mode that's really enticing. We usually buy a new Mario game to tackle level after level, seeing what challenges Nintendo has created for us. In Super Mario Maker for 3DS, there's an entire mode dedicated to testing your platforming skills. Metal Challenge Mode gives you 100 brand new courses to strut your stuff in. This is pretty much an original Mario adventure, albeit with skins of previous Mario games. The levels tucked inside this mode range from simple to quite devious, and there's an extra level of challenge for those that really like to test their skills. Challenge Mode's levels all have unique challenges in them. Sometimes you'll have to hunt down every single coin in a stage, and another time you might be required to find and stomp down every Goomba in the level. Just like the levels themselves, these challenges range from easy to truly torturous. With each challenge level offering two metal challenges on top of the main goal of getting to the exit, Challenge Mode is an extremely enticing addition for this 3DS port. The fun to be had in this mode alone might be enough to warrant a double dip from Wii U owners. Super Mario Maker for 3DS retains the most important element from the original version, the fun. It's still a blast to create levels and check out the amazing challenges other real-life players have crafted. The Metal Challenge mode really does add a nice feather to the cap of the 3DS version as well. The Wii U version still comes out ahead in controls and the online aspects, but Super Mario Maker for 3DS is no slouch. If you don't own the original, this 3DS version is a no-brainer. If you already have the game on Wii U, you'll have to decide if the excellent Metal Challenge mode is enough for you to raid your wallet a second time. Hey guys, RMC here from Go Nintendo. If you like what you saw in the video, why don't you give us a thumbs up and maybe even subscribe? We'd love to have you. If you want to see what else we're up to, you can check out GoNintendo.com for 24-hour Nintendo news. You can visit us on Facebook at Facebook.com slash GoNintendo. You can check us out on Twitter at Twitter.com slash GoNintendoTweet. And we're even over on Instagram at Instagram.com slash GoNintendo. I put all the links in the description just to make it easier for you guys to follow. Thanks a lot!